What's good, family? This is your man, Jimmy Conway, BeatsForLyricist.com, music production tips. In this video, I'm going to show you how to copy your sounds from one pad to another. So if you want to copy pads A1 to A9 or A2 to A14, I'm going to show you how to do that today. This is a question and answer sort of video. Uh, this question was from a guy named producer named Honey A and I just wanted to answer your question I ain't forget about you okay so if you need to copy a sound I got he I got some sounds loaded up on pads one through eight this is what he said so so he said if I had some drums and percussions on pads a one through a eight how do I copy these sounds to pads nine through sixteen and it's pretty easy. Uh, it's easier than I thought, actually. So one thing you could do is if you have the MPC Akai, the Akai MPC Studio Mark II, you can let's say, let's say you want to highlight the, you want to copy, on a copy that shaker. So on the left hand side. In between the pad, in between the pad view and the full level, you'll see where it says copy. Hit copy, and it says copy from pad A8, which is where my shaker was. Now I'm gonna copy it to. I could copy it to let's say pad, what is that? 12, 13, or I can copy it to multiple pads. So let's copy it. Let's copy it to one pad first. Let's just show you. So now I have that sound on A8. And A13. Now you can also copy it to multiple pads if you have the um, MPC Studio Mark II. Let's say you want to copy. No, let's copy from pad. Let's say. Let's say A4. Copy A4, and we're going to copy that to, let's say, pads. Hit do it. I'm going to copy to A9 through A12. So now you could tweak these however you want. You know what I mean? Let me hit undo. Hit undo again. So now we got a regular sound. Another way you could copy your sounds is if you're on a Mac, if you hold down the option button, you can drag and drop one sound to another pad. So give me a second as I readjust my mic. So I'm going to hold the option button. Now on a I'm not sure what it is on a PC. I think it's the Alt. So if you're on a PC, try Alt. But on the on the Mac, it's the Option button. So let's see if I hold Option. And I'm going to drag. Let's say is this. No, that's too abrasive. We'll drag that. We'll copy this Congo loop. I'm going to hold this and drag and drop. Now that's something I didn't know it could do. I didn't know it could do that. I know most applications, if you hold down the option or the or whatever it is on the PC, you could drag and drop different things in different programs. So that's a pretty cool feature too. All right. So yeah, that's basically how it is. Oh, you can also, if you need to copy something over, you can always come over here. Make sure you're in the main menu or uh, let me see. Can we do no, it's not this view, but Okay. Yeah, so make sure you're in the main menu right here. And then you could go all the way over here to your right hand side and you can see your samples that are in your project. So I could drag and drop things from here too. So So I could take this conga. Let's let's move this over a little bit more. Okay. So we could take this conga and we could drag and drop it 
to any path. Okay? So, yeah, that's basically how you copy one sound from another, one sound from one pad to another pad. Okay? Hold down Alt or Option on a Mac, and you can drag and drop one pad to another. Or hit the Copy on your MPC Studio Mark II. And copy your sounds wherever you want. You can copy them in other banks too. Hit do it. I'll go to bank B. All right. I hope this video helps you. This is a Q&A for a producer named Honey A. I hope this helps you and hope helps other people in the community too. Uh, if you have any other questions, you could drop them in the comments below. And I'll try to create a video on it real soon. All right. This is your man, Jimmy Conway, BeatsForLyricist.com. Uh, if you want, you can grab my free drum kit. I'll leave a link in the description below. It's my, it's a free drum kit. Just uh, sign up, download it whenever you can. Uh, also down below will be a link to everything that I use for my studio. My keyboards, my computer, my MPC. They're all Amazon affiliate links. Uh, if you go through my links, I will be, uh, I may be compensated by Amazon. So uh, that would be great if you would. And um, yeah, if you have any other questions, drop them below. This is your man, Jimmy Conway, BeatsForLyricist.com. Music production tips, I'm out.